Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of Chromebook Tips and Tricks video and I'll talk about how to change Chromebook keyboard language. If this is your first time or a repeat visit, thank you for your support. On this channel, I'm always trying new and different ideas. If uh, that is something you're interested in, please visit for more. If you're only interested in Chromebook videos, there'll be links in the description box below. So today I'll talk about how to change your Chromebook uh, language setting for keyboard and also for the device so when it comes to language setting you can have actually uh, both options for, uh, separately for example you can have one language for your device and one language for your keyboard and i'm going to show you both uh, and you can also have you know the same language for, for example let's say american english uh, both for your device and uh, both for your keyboard. So I have the instructions right here, which is very simple and easy to follow. So the first page is how to change the language of the device and the second instructions would be how to change, uh, you know, uh, the language of the input or the keyboard and then how you can have the language change option on your shelf, which, which is basically this part on Chromebook uh, right here. So let's start with uh, the first option. So in order to change language, you go to settings, then advanced, then language and inputs. So the settings would be on the lower right corner where the clock is. So if you just click on it, and then you're going to go on the settings button in the menu box, which would be the uh, wheel right here. So if you click on it, and now you're going to look on the left panel and here you're going to look for advanced option which is right here so if i click on the advanced option and then here you can see that you know you have languages and inputs so you have to just click on that okay so now when i click on it you're going to see that you know you have a language option and input option so the language option is the language for the device and the input option is the option for the keyboard or what you're inputting and you can see that you know currently they're both different one is you know american english for the device language and the input or the keyboard is the british english so let's go to the device language first so we'll click on here and then here you can see that you know you have the option to change so if you just click on the change then you can get a bunch of options from here so let's say you'd like to change it to Canadian English then all you have to do is click on English Canada and then it's asking to um, confirm and restart so if you just hit this button then the Chromebook is going to restart and it's going to change the device language to Canadian English which I'm not going to do right now because I'd like to show you something more so I just cancel that and if I click here to go back now you can see that you know we have the other option which is the option for inputs or keyboard so if i click on here then you can see that there's an option show input option in the shelf so by default it's actually uh, turned off so if you turn this on or slide it to the right uh, that means that you know your keyboard input option is going to be on here so for example if i drag it to the right just Keep an eye here you're going to see that input option showing up on the shelf so you can see that you know it appeared right here and if i drag it back then you'll see that it's gone so let's drag it to the right and then you'll see that you know it's appearing on the shelf so what it does that you know it's your keyboard or input uh, language and currently i have uh, canadian english and uk english and you can even like you know add more if you'd like and then um, you can just like you know have these appearing on your shelf and you can just you know change it from your shelf without even going to the settings so in order to change from the shelf uh, what you have to do you have to just you know hit control shift space or if you hit control and uh, if you hit just you know control and space bar that should work as well so for example uh, if you keep an eye on here currently it shows GB so if I hit control and space then you're going to see that it's changed back to Canadian and if I just you know do the same thing again for example hit control and space 
then you're going to see that you know it's changed back to GB and you can also use uh, control shift and space so it, it does the same thing so this is the control button right here this is the space and this is the shift button so either you can use control shift uh, shift control and space or you can just use control and space it would do the same thing and let's uh, just close the whole thing and now you can see that you know it's showing UK English and if I just hit control space then it's back to Canadian or you can just you know uh, click on here too and then you can see that you know you have the option showing up here and then you can even go back to the settings which we were just a few minutes ago you have to just click here and it will take you to the same settings so it's very easy and simple uh, you know and if you'd uh, like to have options then you can definitely put it on the shelf and then just change it from uh, control and space button so that's all for today